it do my baby booze and welcome back to my channel for another episode of let's play the sims 4 the rockin bachelor challenge i'm a rockin bachelor and rock stars need love too Today is one of my favorite days when it comes to the Bachelor Challenge. So um, let me go ahead and roll the directions from Miss Jen, the queen and creator herself. So yes, it is speed dating day, you guys. I want to take some of the girls out today to try and get to know them better through some one-on-one -on -one time with me. We have the options to go with a random sim or with the sim with the lowest relationship with Mr. Noah. But I think what would be the most fair thing is to go with the sim with the lowest relationship to kind of give them a chance to, you know, just really feel him out and, and let him know why they're here. So I really think that we're going to start out with Carly today. She has the lowest relationship of them all. And then we're going to go over to Tia and do a date with her as well. And then Rita. And then we'll just go from there because I think Honey, Fallon, and Annabelle, and Ivy, they all kind of have like around the same relationship, but the bottom three I really want to focus on today. So we're going to start with Carly and in order to actually ask her on a date, I have to build a tiny bit, like not a lot. Is the maid coming? Because good lord almighty, there is a complete mess in the kitchen right now. Also, I took out Wicked Whims too, so there will be none of that. Carly, you never ended up taking a shower. Oh no. Okay, well, before we start flirting with you, I'm gonna help your energy out just a smidgen in. I also uh, changed up the bathroom so that they can actually go in here and uh, use it at the same time without, you know, getting embarrassed or, you know, walking in on each other. So she's gonna take a shower really fast so that um, we can start kind of making our moves on her. And, and it's nothing, it's not gonna be anything too serious either. Like I literally went over to her um, bachelor challenge, Jen's, to just kind of see how she went about this when you don't have any relate like any romantic relationship with them at all whatsoever and all she did was basically flirt with the girls until they had like something some just a tiny little bit of romance so that just until the option comes up you know so she's just gonna take her shower who was the other people on the list whoa 16 grand wait where did we get all that from god they're all getting so many followers so many followers where did the 16 grand come from i have no idea i may be rich but i still hustle you don't need to know where i get it from well i mean i'm <laughs> i'm not about to complain but uh, all right he's gotta pee so bad so i think that's where he was actually headed to anyways which is perfect because he can meet carly in the bathroom as well so yeah that's right we need to go with carly rita and tia that's right. Okay, so go to the bathroom, sir. Come on. Come on over here and use this. You just use it. We don't need to do any other kind of shenanigans. Is he good other than that then? Oh, he's kind of hungry, so maybe we could go somewhere to eat with her. We got girls showering galore in here. Hello, ladies. He is just like, yes. We're gonna wait for her. Nah, 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 nah. Go here and just wait for her. Carly is taking one long shower. My goodness. We're gonna uh, get rid of her embarrassing buff here and uh, her hygiene is pretty much done. So we'll just have her come out now. This is gonna be a long day because we gotta flirt with these girls enough to get them to want to go on a date with me. I also kind of redecorated very, very lightly. I added some more like music kind of decor to the game. So I have this really cool piece of CC that's a guitar fishbowl. And it's literally a fishbowl too. Like we have a fish just kind of, you know, chilling in there and you can like get a different kind of fish if you want to and all that jazz. Um, okay, so Carly is out. Where is Carly now? I don't see her, but I see the door is open. Okay, go here. All right, and then we're gonna have him go here. Okay, we gonna we gonna meet in the middle. Meet me in the middle. Okay, so we're gonna just be good to her, like give her a heartfelt compliment. Yeah, no, try to. Oh, 
She moved on me. Try to get her on, or get, yeah, get him on her good side. Rave about favorite singers, I suppose. Um, hey, Carly, stop walking away from me. Oh, wait, I think she's going over to the bar to sit down. Okay, that works too. As soon as I noticed that Noah was about to talk to me, I brought him to the bar because your girl knows him the best. Look at all of these drinks that she's been making. What is this? We have a whole ass bottle of nectar here. Is this nectar? We have so many drinks. What is this? Pistachio nectar. Oh my God. I don't want to leave now. <laughs> okay, Um. so we already have something going on here. Be flirted with. Oh, she's flirting with me. Thank goodness, because I really thought for a second that she wasn't here for me. Like for the last episode, like I was really, really scared that she really didn't. Oh, ask on date. Why not? Because uh, the, the thing is going on, but we can actually ask her on a date. So all we needed was the bare minimum. So we're just going to go ahead and uh, get rid of that. The It was unsuccessful, but I'd say it was pretty damn successful because we gained a lot of followers, honestly, just from having them over overnight. Like a lot of, most of them were sleeping the whole time. So, you know, ask her on a date and we'll see what we have in like, hey, go ahead and do it. Come on now, ask on date. And uh, we'll see what we have in the neighborhood as far as like venues or places to go. So yeah, we're gonna try and get as many dates going as possible. What do we have downtown here? So we have the Golden Goose, which we already went to. We have a pool, we have a spa, we have a karaoke bar and we have a tattoo parlor, par parlor slash bar. Okay. You know what? Why don't we go to mm, the street side karaoke bar? Possibly. Uh, yeah, let's go to the karaoke bar. All right, here we are at street side karaoke. No one ever shows up this dang early, but. I brought Carly to my favorite karaoke bar because she's a songwriter. Here's her chance to show me some talent. Did he really just bring me to a karaoke bar? Ugh, just because I can write songs doesn't mean I can sing. Is this her date clothes? I think I put their date clothes in their party wear. So let me just check out real quick because I have specific outfits for dates. So party wear, no. Oh no, she's wearing her hot weather outfit. Let's put her in her party wear though because I just feel like that's a, um, like they were, she she put that on in a, like with a date in mind. So let me uh, just talk to her a little bit, you know, get to know her. Um, so we are supposed to get our date to socialize with us 10 times, sit and talk to them, and then flirt with them three times. So we can also end the date early if we get all of these things complete. So for right now, I kind of want to just like go over and, and do karaoke with her. Sing duet. I feel like that would be the cutest little thing. Okay, so we're going to do what would be like a good thing. And we'll do pop, I guess, with Carly. We'll see how they are together when it comes to, could you duet with me and make it sound good, girl? Could you do that? Could you, could you? Oh, we got the paparazzi checking us out already. Like, I didn't think they'd be out this early, but you know, they're the paparazzi are like cockroaches. They never go away, I swear. They never go away. Also, we all, we do have a vending machine that we could buy a little drink or something from so that his hunger can get taken care of. But look at, okay, let me, let me go over into town tab mode and see what these guys sound like together. Of course, he's amazing. Wasn't expecting anything less. Oh, oh God. Oh my God. Look at his face. He's just like, yeah, girl, you got it. But you gotta give the girl credit for trying. I mean, she is in the presence of a rock star and for her to just let go like that, let loose and actually, you know, get into the jazz of things, like that actually says a lot about her character. And I honestly, like, I was not feeling Harley in the last episode, guys. I really wasn't. But after today, maybe, I don't know. She seems to be in kind of a better mood today, so we'll see. Oh, look, she just turned. She got into the groove, girl. Yes. How embarrassing. That girl cannot carry a tune, but it's sort of endearing. I think he really appreciates the fact that she even tried. You know, the fact that she knows she can't sing. <laughs> she really cannot sing. But she tried anyways, and that, I thought that was really cute. So let's sit over here together. Sit together, and then we're gonna do a little chit chat. Little chitting, little chatting, you know. Boy, what are you, what are you mad about? What? Oh, he's, he's hungry, so he's mad at me. It's like, 
Feed me! You <laughs> feed me, Alyssa. I'm sorry. After uh, after this date, you can you can get fed, all right? But for right now, I need you guys to socialize a little bit, all right? So we are going to let's just be friendly with each other a little bit more. We gotta socialize eight more times. So discuss interests and also maybe a deep conversation as well. Deep conversation. There we go. Let me see here. Oh, we're getting her flirty too. Um, I think that was yeah, that was a thing to be flirty at the same time or to get them flirty i don't know we got paparazzi just flooding us burge bur bur burgeson the burgeson guy he just fainted oh <gasps> he just fainted oh my god <laughs> i have never seen a sim faint in a present oh my god dude that is insane okay tell a gross joke because we're supposed to joke with her too so uh I, does that count as an interaction i hope it does oh oh did she not like that she was just like, oh, you're bad. Let's praise the vampire lifestyle. He's like, I would love to never have to sleep to be able to just rock, rock, rock all night long, all the time for thousands of years. And she's like, yeah, that's interesting, I guess. I don't know. And we have one more socialization to go. And then that will be complete. And then uh, we got to flirt with her a, a couple more times. Guys, why are you sitting at this table with me? Like, you really think? Look at this. Look at this scene. Like, we can't even go out. Wait, is she like berating me right now? What is she doing? Be yelled at? <gasps> oh no, Carly. Uh, she's yelling at him. Oh my God. Out of nowhere, Carly starts yelling at me. I was shocked. So I tried changing the subject. I don't care who you are. If you say something I don't like, I'm going to speak my mind about it. Okay. Okay. You know what? That was that was just uncalled for. I don't know why you're yelling at me. I didn't do anything wrong to you. So, I mean, I, she, she's just like kind of going about it like she didn't even say anything. Like she's laughing and smiling away. We, we got the socializations kind of done. Maybe if we flirt with her three times, maybe they'll... Uh, oh, wait. That's why nothing is popping up. I'm on her. <laughs> like, what is going on? on here bolt pickup line and oh my god please don't faint this time nina don't faint nina don't faint nina don't faint oh there she goes nina went down <laughs> nina went down so let's go ahead and um and she is she yelling at me again oh 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 he did not like that she said something to him and he was like okay this date is done the second time she yelled at me i was 100 percent over our date this date is done but we did get a little bit oh noah's a bro bros love watching sports being around other bros and no handle how to handle their juice okay well you know he didn't exactly like what she just did there i don't know what she just did but he's walking away so i think this date is officially over so let's just end the date early we we got the socializations done but she's yelled at him two different times like that was that was really bad so i don't know how he feels about that you're gonna have to let me know in the comments down below but we're gonna have carly go home and we are going to bring over tia is going to be the next date. I think this is Tia. Yeah, so let's bring Tia here. Look at her. She is doing so good. I think she really wants the chance to like prove that she is here for him. And this is kind of like her last chance to do it as eliminations are in the next episode. Woo! -hoo -hoo. Stand aside, Carly. Valentia has come to claim her man. Okay, so uh, it's perfect that we can just kind of get her alone right now so that we can get their relationship up high enough to actually ask her on a date. So let's go over to her and and discuss interests and see if she's down to go on a date with me. We need to go somewhere to eat because he is starving Marvin right now. So I really need to add some restaurants or something. I don't have too many venues as of right now, but for the next dates, we're, we're, we're going to try and go somewhere different each time or each day or something. Oh my God, guys, leave me alone. I think this is the worst part about being a celebrity. You get gawked at every two <laughs> seconds by everybody. And she's just like, not nah, about that life. Come on. Are you going to go over to her like she's running away <laughs> go to her noah go to her run run away from these crazy people oh my god they're following him imagine this being your life guys not a seconds moment for privacy none oh man i wish we could have a mixologist here hold on a second where are you going why are you leaving your butt your thing is literally to chat with her and you're walking away why all these fans are just getting in the way right now he's getting so peeved about it. He literally had to just leave and just 
<laughs> and just go grunt and then come back because he was just getting so peeved. Okay, so we're gonna go talk to her, or we are talking to her, <laughs> but we're gonna tell an unbelievable story and let's see if we can flirt just a smidgen tidgen to try to get her to possibly go on a date with me. We got pictures being taken everywhere by so many people, but hopefully it'll work. Oh, look at her outfits. She's so cute. I, I always forget like the outfits. When I have a full house of Sims, you know, I forget what outfits I put who in and that is so cute. I love her little outfit. Dude, man, this is so annoying. Why do you gotta run to the front just to talk? Like you can talk perfectly fine wherever you are. My goodness, who is in my conversation right now? Dude, Nina, butt the hell out. I don't need you. Okay, so let's try and flirt with her. I already tried to do it, but um, we got interrupted a little bit. So hurry up and flirt, hurry up and flirt. She is digging it, she loves it. Okay, let me see here if we can ask her on a date yet. Oh, we should be able to. We have a little bit of a bar now. Oh, we don't, we can't, can we not really? Okay, flirt one more time to see if, we, we just need to get this date going here. So Thern, Th Thorn. <laughs> Thorn is saying uh, he heard we became friends with Carly. I suppose. I suppose we're friends. Kind of. I uh, would like to be more than that with most of these ladies. Or all of them. You know, I would love I would love to be more than that with any of these ladies. But we need to find the one. Anyways, I'm going on a tangent. Let's ask her on a date. And I, oh man, I don't know where to go. We, we gotta go somewhere with food. Main priority right now food. <laughs> Let's see here. You know what? It's it's like midday. I think this would be the perfect time to go to the pool. So let's head over there. Okay, so we're at the galaxy pool. What better place for a date with a sexy woman other than the local pool? I was low-key so happy Noah took me to a pool. Perfect opportunity to show off my swimsuit. The first thing that I'm going to look for is a bar. <laughs> Is this like, do we technically get a bar here? Like, I know there is a bar, but like, do we get a bartender here? Let's hire a mixologist just so that we can have like a little bit of food at some point. So let's try and socialize with our date a little bit. Oh, we can already do our first kiss. Interesting. Let's do, oh no, not not a pickup line, not a pickup line. We're not trying to, fl well, I guess we can flirt three times, but all he wants to do is like flirty stuff right off the bat. Let's brighten our day. I wish we could like sit in the pool somewhere and talk, but that's not a thing. So let's uh, be friends. Friendly. complain about the heat it is so damn hot outside that's what I took that's why I took you to the pool why don't we go over here then and sit together and just chat over at the bar at the pool is that the bartender Who's the bartender? I think that is the indeed the bartender. I love how the bartender is wearing her swimsuit. Perfect. And we are going to definitely order food. We should just get something kind of light. Why don't we get caviar crackers for right now? And uh, I guess we can kind of share. Oh my God, her in her swimsuit though. Boy, when I saw Tia in her swimsuit, I had to pick up my job from the floor. Woo. I know I'm fine. Eat your heart out, Noah. She is gorgeous. Let's have a deep conversation and we're going to joke with her. So let's, funny, 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 funny. Let's do a funny story because he's got a lot of stories being that he is a rock star and everything, you know. Oh, look at this, look at this view in the back. They are so, wouldn't they be cute together? Like they have like kind of cute, I don't know. They would They would look adorable together is all I'm saying. They would. Just, they just would. So let's flirt with her a couple more times, do a bold pickup line. What we really need to focus on is uh, the socialization part. So ask about her day. How are you doing today? How are you doing? I'm feeling a lot better now that I have food. Let's enthuse about our meal. I'm loving this food, this pool food. Whose drink is this? This looks amazing. Oh, a mimosa. I love mimosas. It looks nothing like a mimosa. Mimosas are, oh, hello, booty. Mimosas are orange, but uh, that is clear. So that's interesting. Where is she going? Where are you going? No, I need to socialize with you. Let me socialize. So uh, let's be friendly. Now we can complain about the dish. Okay, well, why don't you make up your mind? Do you like it or not? So let's discuss food flavors. I know this is, this isn't exactly, oh no, is he stinky now? Oh no. Okay, we're gonna get his hygiene up. We gotta go home after this date and just kind of take care of his needs. And then we'll go on another date with Rita. I'm pretty sure she is the, 
last one. Let me see here. Let me look at our relationships now. So what were like the worst relationships have quickly become the best relationships as they're the only ones with, you know, romantic socialization on there now. But those are also going to be the people who are up for elimination because I don't want to eliminate someone I don't get to go on a date with and like don't get the chance to get to know better, you know? I want to at least be able to get to know these ladies and then make my decision from there. So let's make a toast to um to the rockin wait to yeah the rockin bachelor to finding love on reality tv and she's like oh boy you stink <laughs> Did you see what she was like? Oh my God. Can you please put your pits down? I don't need, I don't need to smell that. <laughs> that is so great. Okay. Um, why am I clicking on him? I need to click on her. Okay. Eh, eh, All right. <laughs> Let's do another deep conversation. What are your interests? What do you like to do for fun? We could share a secret, but I don't think we know each other like that. Maybe if you make like the top three or something, I can share a secret, secret with you. So let's, uh, go ahead and complain about the heat once again. I don't know. There's not enough social interactions in The Sims 4. I wish there were way more so we could talk about different stuff, but we can always imagine. You could, you know, use our imagination. Oh, wait. We have actually socialized with her 10 times. Actually, this date has been going very well, so why don't we go ahead and do one more romantic interaction. Oh, we could cuddle. I have been wanting to do this interaction. I just downloaded it. I know he stinks, but I really want to um, cuddle while cloud gazing because this is the cutest little thing ever. So what they do, what are you doing? Why are you like whispering? Oh, here we go. Oh, little girl, can you please move? Oh my God, that is the cutest thing. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. <gasps> Oh my god. Okay, I have to take a screenshot because that is so cute. I wish he didn't stink right now. Oh my gosh. Look at them though. <laughs> She's like, oh my god. Close your arm. As soon as I felt Tia in my arms, I knew I didn't want to let her go. Y'all smell that in the air? That's the smell of a rock star falling in love with me. Close your arm. This girl is just walking all over us right now. <laughs> oh my god. That is so adorable. I love this animation so much. I don't think I'll ever use like a normal cloud gazing interaction ever again because it's this, just the cutest thing. I mean, unless they're like just friends or something, but you know, most, fr well, no, some friends just cloud gaze, I suppose. You can do that. It's not exactly like a romantic interaction in itself. I'm just trying to take thumbnail screenshots. Don't mind me. Um, but yeah, I think we are good after this. Oh, kiss our date. Oh, it's going that well, huh? Okay, well, you know what? After this, I'm gonna let him kiss her. I'm just gonna let her let let I'm just gonna let it happen. Can we? Hold on. Can we do that? If we have to push more in order to do that, then I'm not gonna do it. Yeah, let's not do it then. Okay, so let's go ahead and get out of here because that's actually giving them more like of a intimate intimate kind of like thing like it's giving them more of a love bar which i'm not really trying to do but if that does mean that i can kiss her now nope nope okay let's go ahead and end the date then well actually let's let's joke with her a couple more times i want to i want to at least have a good date like the only reason i didn't have a good date with carly was because she was being mean to me man so let's can we make funny faces let's make funny faces and then just do a couple more couple more joking kind of things be funny and oh, we have an inside joke already okay let's do the inside joke he she loved that she was eating out of the palm of his hand there she likes him a lot i really do i think she likes him a lot the first episode was really a hiccup and i really don't want to judge her and carly based on what they did in the first episode seeing as the mod kind of makes them do things that they wouldn't normally do but we're gonna go ahead and end this date early we got a silver medal for it cool let's go home the both of us so he can kind of take care of his needs and then move on to the next date with rita i suppose and i think that's how we're gonna do these speed dates from now on i think we're gonna go from the bottom people like the people who have the least relationship with him at that current time and then we'll base our eliminations on the people we went on date dates with but he is stinking up a storm he's leaving a damn like 20 foot trail with this green shit oh my god or green stuff sorry uh but we'll see we'll see you back at the mansion how did four build items get removed from my house while it was gone? That is so strange. It looks like freaking Carly never even... Oh, she she is 
she's thinking about how stinky he is. She's like, ugh, get away from me. She is so mean. What the hell? Why are you so, like, what, what went wrong in your life for you to be so dang mean? Let's sing in the shower. And then what else do we have to do? Uh, his uh, energy is really low, but he's still hungry too. Okay, so he's gonna uh, go to the bathroom after he showers. So we'll use that. And then he needs to eat first because we don't really have a whole lot of places. Oh my God, to go. Tia actually made this. Ooh, this actually looks really good. Cool. So he'll have a little bit of a meal before we leave. Let's go to the spa with uh, Rita. After having kind of a long day, you know, it's nice to just unwind and relax. We have uh, Ivy over here. She kind of followed him into the garage, like waiting for him to come out. She definitely wants to have a little bit of a word with him. Of course I was a little jealous they were all getting a little one-on-one -on -one time with Noah. I mean, I want to get one-on-one -on -one time with Noah. What makes you guys so special? She has to pee. Girl, go pee. All right, I'm just going to speed through a little bit. Oh, he has a little buff from that um from that cloud gazing he did with Tia. Passion under the clouds. What's better than looking at the beautiful morning clouds? Cuddling with the one you love. Okay, well, the person you like. Someone you like, okay? The warmth of the cuddle is something to remember. Well, he definitely, I think he definitely had a very good date with Tia. We we got to see how the date with Rita goes as well, but yeah, so we'll see we'll see what happens. How is Rita doing on her needs as well? Let me uh, make sure. Rita, Rita. Oh, she's good. She is better than good. She is like, she's having a blast right now. Oh, she's going to go practice? What? Wait, you play guitar? Probably badly. I mean, I'm sure. Let me see if she actually has a, a skill in that. Oh, whoa. What? Girl, you're surprising. I didn't know you had a skill in guitar. Oh my God. And 10. She is singing um, level 10. Wow. Wow. I didn't know that. Okay. He's uh, he's eating Tia's. What is this called? Again, uh, pan fried tilapia. And he is good. Oh my God. He is so ready for a little night out at the spa. Let's just go. Okay. So let's go over to her. Oh, he got a new quirk refined palate as a celebrity noah has become accustomed to excellent quality meals eating food that oh no eating food that doesn't meet his lofty quality expectations will make him increasingly uncomfortable that is such a bad quirk to have because you know i can't i can't control how good the food is that he eats it just comes out that way man all right well let's go over to her and he's just gonna be like whoa i didn't know you play guitar that is really interesting i didn't know that about you that is very attractive to a rock star i will say to have the skill of playing some instruments here i haven't seen any of the other girls play this guitar and he's just like wow she's cute and she uh, plays guitar oh we can mentor her <gasps> oh my god mentor wait this could be our little date too he's like um just you know pick that one a little bit and then that one and she's like okay let me see here she is loving getting a little bit of um attention from him right now did i just hit the jackpot Rita is sexy and she plays the guitar. As soon as Noah walked in that room, I knew I had an advantage over the other girls. I mean, who's sexy and plays guitar in this house? It's me. But I need to go get her on her own a little bit. So let me uh, add her to a group. And then we're going to go out here by the pool and we're going to sit here together. You ready to go to the spa, Rita? I'm pretty excited. I'm pretty darn excited to go to the spa. All right. So we're out here by uh, eh, 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 eh. sit here together. Don't you try to leave. He was going to go try to talk to Annabelle. No, no. Come here, sit together. Oh my God, it is one in the morning right now. <laughs> oh no. At least both of them kind of have, you know, the uh, energy to kind of be out for a little while, be out a little late. So uh, he is going to flirt with her a little bit. He's like so over today. He's like, God, this is so much. This is so much. At least you're a serial romantic. You got it going on. It's all good. So uh, he flirted with her. Is that enough to ask on a date? Perfect. And we are going to go to the spa. We'll see you there. Okay, guys, we are here at this spa with um, beautiful little Rita here. I decided to take Rita to the spa for two reasons. One, for a relaxing massage, and two, to see her in a towel. Okay, let's see what we can do right away. Why don't we go over here, possibly? We can uh, get in together. Oh, we could skinny dip, too. Oh, that'd be fun. That'd be really fun. But uh, our main our main concern is, like, sitting and talking to her. So I think the hot tub would be, like, just the ticket for right now. And then after we uh, lounge in there a little bit. Why are you getting out? Get in together, please. Here we go. Oh, my God. The stupid paparazzi will not leave us alone. All right, let's go over to her and 
chat with her, be friendly, and brighten her day. Splash. Uh, I don't know if she'd like that, but let's see. Let's see if she can kind of take a little bit of some playfulness and just splash her a little bit. Let's see how she'll react to that. Oh, we could ask to scar, st scar gaze. Why don't we have a deep conversation? Oh, she loved that. She ended up splashing him back like, oh, you little, you little turd, little turd basket. He's actually having a pleasant time right now. We could gossip. Uh, I don't think he's a huge fan of gossip, to be honest. Given that he is famous and people gossip about him all the time, I don't think he appreciates it very much. He wants to do a duet, doesn't he? Yeah, he wants to do a duet. Why don't we do a duet with her? Why don't we do a duet with her, actually, once we get back at the house? So we need to socialize with you a little bit more. But she's I think she's done with the hot tub. So let's go up here and see what we have. Oh, wait, I forgot there's more down here. That's right. We could get massages. I could give you a massage or you could give me a massage. I don't know. I could, like, have that be a challenge. I feel like that's kind of mean to make her g give me a massage, though. We could get massages together, but, like, I want to be next to her, you know? So why don't we actually uh, grab two of these and put them in one room? Let's, like, move this out a little bit, give it some more room, and then we're going to have one right next to it. Have them kind of right next to each other. So get massage. Get a, ooh, a stone massage from Julia Wright. Yeah, go ahead and do it. And then I need you to get a massage oh man is julia the only dang massage therapist here he's gonna get his little massage and then i need her to get a massage oh she's getting ready to go she's so cute she is so adorable like honestly she's so beautiful why don't we hire a massage therapist then man this is so not how i pictured it this is so not how i pictured this going mm, i wonder get a swedish massage oh zoe is here zoe's here okay let's get a massage a stone massage massage from Zoe Patel. Can the paparazzi leave us alone for two damn seconds? Come on. Oh, he's loving this massage though, but it would be a lot more relaxing if these people weren't here flashing in my face every two seconds. Come on, go get your massage. Uh, he's he's going to be done by the time her massage even gets started, I swear. He's probably done right now. Yep, just about. Just about. So we're going to wait for her massage. I wonder if we can talk to her while she's getting a massage. Possibly tell a dramatic story. Is that going to work while she's sitting here or laying here? No, it's not. It is not going to happen. Oh, man, I don't want this date to go by and us not actually, you know, finish this. Because it's not, it's not their fault. They're just, you know, busy getting massages and stuff. Oh, she is getting trapped treated like none of the other girls have oh that looks so nice that actually looks so good can i have that happen i don't have 300 dollars to spend on it though <laughs> where you going make a screwdriver you alcoholic oh my god you know what go ahead and do it i don't care at this point okay why don't we why don't we go here we can relax together in the sauna oh wait he's not gonna make that drink anymore actually that's a good thing that is a damn good thing he drinks way too much it is 5 30 a.m right now Woo, chile okay um why don't we have her kind of end her massage early. I want to be able to go into this sauna and like talk to her before this date is over. Are you a, um, who's a celebrity here? We got someone taking pictures of someone. Is, is he over here? No. Okay. Oh, it's officially summer. A brain boosting yoga class is beginning in 30 minutes. Please find and notify the yoga instructor if you wish to participate. Okay. Um, where's the yoga instructor? I don't see the yoga instructor anywhere, but I'd love to be a part of that class. That'd be kind of fun. All right, well, I'm not seeing it, but we'll have her come over here and relax with him a little bit. We need to talk while we're in here. Just a little bit. Oh, she got a little uh, down to even more skivvies. Okay, what are you doing here? Worst massage. <gasps> Worst massage ever. Things may be worse now after the mishandling of that misguided masseuse. Oh, no. This is like a five-star damn yoga place. That's dumb. All right, well, let's be friendly with her and brighten her day. Let's complain about our problems as in like complaining about our massage. Let's just flirt a little bit. We're trying to be flirty at the same time. Like that's te technically one of our thingies that we have to uh, achieve. So if we flirt with her a little bit, maybe that could uh, help us along a little bit. Why don't we compliment her appearance? and see if she likes that at all, possibly. Possibly. Compliment her outfit. Come on, I'm trying to really, I'm trying to get these interactions up. Let's try and be flirty at the same time. So if we try to be a little romantic, let's, uh, oh, we could promise to dedicate a song to her just because he, she has shown like interest in music and like actually showed it to him and like, you know, he knows about it. So he could be like, you know, I think I'm gonna dedicate a song to you. Oh, she's flirty, she's flirty, okay. I 
need to get him flirty. What if she flirts back with him? I'm just trying to get him flirty now. Why don't we compliment his appearance? Be like, oh, you are, you are so sexy without your shirt on. Yes. Come on, come on, come on. Get him flirty. They're having a suggestive conversation right now. Oh, he's not flirty from that. All right. Well, I don't want to push it too hard, but um, we did get our date kind of figured out. So, all right. Why don't we uh, tell a story? Oh, no, never mind. Date's over. All right. <laughs> okay, well, that wasn't, I mean, it wasn't the best date ever because we didn't really get to talk that much in the beginning, but it wasn't the worst either. So let's go homesies. Okay, guys, we are back home. So I think the first thing I need to get him to do is, uh, well, he's pretty tired, so we need to take a nap. But um, before he does that, I really need him to go ahead and harvest all of these roses here so that, um, you know, they don't go bad or die or anything. And then he's going to take a quick little nap after that. So let me know, you guys, how you think the dates went. Who do you think had the best date with him? And who do you think had the worst date with him? And uh, I'll keep that in mind for our elimination. So, you know, just keep in mind that I'm keeping that in mind. So I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode right here. My recording, my raw recording is already 50 minutes long. So definitely gotta go ahead and uh, leave it here. But yes, again, let me know what you think of what you saw today. Who do you think had the best date? Who do you think had the worst date? And I will see you all in my very next video. Bye loves. Mwah.